Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Borderlands, the zombie island of Dr. Ned. So, uh, in the last part, we uh, finished up. Oh, same thing he's talking about. We have new missions. Uh, yeah, last time we were just at Dr. Ned's place and uh, found out he was doing experiments. He just wanted to help people. <laughs> So, uh, leave it to the professionals. To, whom, or to whomever is still alive, when the zombie issue first arose, there was a lone zealot among the workforce who demanded a chance to destroy the evil that had befallen our mill. The board decided that it couldn't hurt to have someone out there, like, or out there trying to stop the problem while employees were being lost. The Jacobs Corporation has not heard from him since that time. There is a moderate monetary reward for determining the outcome of his endeavors. Or endeavors. Oh, okay, so uh, I guess we have to check that out. I mean, um, I do have another quest. If you check right here, I do forgot. I did forget to go after Pumpkinhead, like I said I would. Uh, but uh, when we do collect enough brains, I guess I can cash that in and also talk to Pumpkinhead at the same time. So I don't think that could hurt anything. So uh, in the meantime, we're just gonna keep uh, running through. I'm about to level up again, so uh, that will be nice. And um, I'm thinking that uh, by the time I level up just enough. Uh, I might just move on to playthrough 2 and go straight with the General Nox things if I can, if they would even let me. So, uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. So, uh, sorry about these uh, videos. I just don't update them that often. I'm really trying to finish The Legend of Dragoon first. Uh, as much as I can, because, uh, well, that, that has been going on for uh, way longer than I would like it to. And someone is texting me, so... Uh, I'll be right back. Alright, and we are back. So, a uh, minor, minor delay in that call. Uh, it's from my mom. Uh, she wanted to see if I wanted to eat one of the... Well, something she made, but I didn't want to. So, uh, let's keep going. Uh, let's see, look, plenty of brains. I'm not really going after them. I mean, uh, I'm just getting them if it's convenient enough. And, God, there's so many defilers. I hate these enemies. And it's just the defilers I hate. Don't care about the other ones. Be a freaking Tankenstein for all I care. You haven't seen the Tankenstein yet, but uh, we'll see it soon enough. At least I'm hoping in the next area we will. Alright, so... Ah, oh, come on! Another defiler! Are you fucking kidding me? It's just all they throw at me. Man, man. Be so much easier just to pelt a shitload of shots out of them, but I really can't do that. Just, uh, just not really optimal. So, uh, we're gonna have to travel this path to actually get over to uh, the area we need to do our mission in. So, let's keep moving. So, us. Uh, Sorry I don't really have anything to speak about. I mean, it's just been a while. I'm trying to get back into this game. Uh, <laughs> when I first popped in this game, I was having a little bit of trouble uh, with the controls because I've been playing Rage on the 360. And, uh, well, that game is quite unique for what it is. And uh, it's not bad. I mean, I've grown more and more accustomed to liking it. But it does have some flaws, but uh, nothing that's too big. So let's open this up. Dang. <laughs> Alright, let's go in here. I need to restock on ammo. See, my ammo's quite low right now. I do like pelting shots everywhere, but uh, it's just not that great. Alright, so right up here. Uh, Berserker mod. Nothing useful for, our, for us, at least. That's a damn shame. But in the meantime, we can scrap some revolver ammo. Back up to 160. Let's see, what else do we need? Okay, nothing else. Alright. Seem to be doing pretty good over here. Yeah, it's, it's just, we're just really weak right now. It's just uh, a little upsetting sometimes. I forgot what other weapons. God, that's not the weapon switching button. <laughs> uh, okay, we have an equalizer. I almost forgot about that. Yeah, we can use this. Easy enough to set them on fire and not worry about them anymore. Yeah, I would would have liked a headshot out of that and uh, gotten brained, but not the most easy thing to do. So we're just gonna stand here and let them come to us, since that seems to be what they like to do. All right. 
I have no doubt, like, it's probably easier to get your precision shots with a mouse and keyboard, like a lot of PC elitists like to say, but, uh, the thing is, though, um, it must, might be easier for you, but, uh, for me, it's not the same because, uh, I'm more used to this control method, so. It's just whoever's more used to whatever. Uh, that's what you should be going for, but, yeah, you know, a lot of people don't understand that. So, let's see. And there's our level up. Ah, freaking midgets. It's a lot more annoying than I remember, but maybe because I don't usually play through this uh, game that solo that often. I mean, I usually have friends I play with, but uh, it doesn't seem like anybody ever wants to pick up this game and play it anymore. It's a real damn shame. So we get a caustic law. I mean, nothing useful for us. Yeah, burn to death. Flaming psycho once again, huh? <laughs> Even in death. So at least we've cleared out what we needed so far. Um, I'm just going to clear that guy out first. Yeah, okay, he died in one shot. Alright, let's put a point in. Uh, okay, we're still going for swipe. I almost forgot we had blood wings still. What do you got? Acid explosive. Okay, explosive wing is the best one we have. Because uh, the corrosive element will not do anything for us. So it looks like we have a... Nope. No, oh, just a defiler. Those annoying assholes. Should be a lot more swarming me right now. I'm just gonna keep moving forward and shooting at them. I knew I ran into something. Oops. Yeah, really annoying. I can't get a shot off when they do hit me because of the damn knockback. Yeah, easy enough, right? Whoa! Back off, sir. just don't seem to be doing enough damage anymore. It's really, really annoying. Ah, oh, come on! I keep pushing the wrong button to switch weapons. It's starting to piss me off. I just wish games just more often had pre-mappable buttons so I don't have to keep learning new control layouts and then, like, screw up all the time because of that. I need to just have a unified control system or... You know, let you remap your own buttons. I mean, how difficult is that? Damn. Alright, so the first thing we want is over here. I mean, it's one of these echo recorders, so let's go for it. The night here is as chill as a sheepskake's teeth in a winter's morn. But it does not dampen my resolve. I found strength in prayer, and with little whiskey I have remaining in my flask. Ah, the monster of the hospital. His arms proved to be harder to kick than the rest of this rabble. He nicked me in the neck. Well, starting to feel strange. Hopefully I'll last tonight. At least it is a full moon to keep me company. Yeah, about that. <laughs> uh, you'll find out more as we uh, go up here. Because uh, I did grab the echo recorder out of uh, sequence. Uh, obviously it's not really going to make too much sense. So uh, it seems like, um, let's see, combustion, so this is our best damage. It's a little annoying. I mean, it's a seven round clip. It's decent for stuff, but wow, you, you went pretty far, man. <laughs> Damn, dude. Where did these things come from? Like, on my playthrough right now, it's just getting really annoying. Like, I have to deal with so many defilers and those guys that throw shit at you. It just seems, um... Just bad luck, I mean, with the spawning, I mean, I don't usually have to deal with these guys that often. Usually it's just the regular zombies, so I don't understand why uh, they're just spawning all these things that are really annoying for me right now. My shield's, like, worth nothing, which pretty much, you, as you play the game, uh, you learn that your shield really isn't worth crap. Don't even bother with it. I mean, uh, later in the game, I mean, it's decent to have, like, a thousand shield or something, but... Really, it still goes down in like two, three seconds, so what's the point? What's the real point? I mean, a lot of people just stick with like the Wee Wee Super Booster, because that's, that's good enough. I mean, you don't need anything more. Yeah, launch yourself, stupid midget. Oh, come on, just stand the fret still. Alright, just need to move up here. Got more of these zombies. Oh, come on, you should have died in one hit. That is ridiculous. 
Yeah, a lot of them just spawn down there, so they will be coming towards me in a little bit. Really probably should be aiming with the scopes or sights more, but I just really don't like that. I'm just used to playing Rage. Uh, rage sights are not really that worth it. I usually uh, hit fire everything and uh, works just as well in this game. I'm just used to it. I remember running around with a soldier with like uh, a Draco, which is um, the SNS Glorious Massacre with Times for Fire, and uh, just hip firing everything really. Wow, I did not get you? Are you freaking kidding me? Man, what is with this accuracy? Maybe I need to farm for new weapons off screen. Jeez. Just kind of getting tired of this. Alright, so, uh, there's... Are you kidding me? Come on. Ah, uh, more of these damn stupid suicide zombies. Just can't see where they come from. Oh my god, that is not the jump button. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably gonna fail a lot because of the messed up control methods I have. <laughs> can't really change it. Alright, so we have a huge creature we have to deal with here. Um, if we just activate the quest, so it shows there may be some side effects. Alright. So you might recognize this uh, this creature, so... I'll just give you a quick look at him. And uh, you might remember that hat. Yes, this is Hank Reese from the Echo Recorders. Yeah, Hank Reese, wear skag. Nice hat. <laughs> um, he seems a little hard at first, but uh, he's actually quite easily dispatched, as with most bosses in this game, I mean, watch watch this with the Combustion Hellfire. Just run up to him, and just, well, actually, it's not that fast. Oh well, quick enough. But uh, usually, if I have a faster one, uh, he should go down in about 2-3 seconds. This one took a little while because the fire rate's really low, but uh, nothing I can really do about that, so. As you can see, generally hospital, a little pun on the show, I believe. Uh, I've never watched it, but... Um, well, never heard anything about it, really. I just know people watch it. So let's see what we get. It really would be nice to get something new. Um, kind of mix things up, but right now there's really nothing I care about. So, alright, so uh, we grab the antidote. So let's run all the way back. I mean, there's nothing... Well, there's one more quest we have in this area, but uh, it's not available to us yet, so that's quite annoying. And, uh, well, it's easily enough... Or easy enough to get out of this area because, uh, well, just run off and uh, go towards the entrance. You don't have to deal with a vertical crap. So let's keep running through. Yeah, I wasn't expect. Ah, God, that's not the jump button. Uh, why is the jump button enraged? Not Borderlands. I need to get that in my head. And the right bumper is not weapon switch. That is why. So, so you can see those were usually my most two used. Uh, buttons and uh, screwing them all up. So uh, in the meantime, switch back to my freaking equalizer so I can regain ammo without paying for it. And make it back to Jacob's Cove to turn in these two quests. And uh, we should get another quest. Uh, yeah, it should should be on this uh, path right over here. Uh, if those birds don't bother me. Which uh, seems very unlikely. Yeah. They're already circling, so uh, they're getting ready to attack. But we can take care of that before they can do anything. I need to stay near the coast, because uh, that way I don't have to deal with running into random objects in my way. Oh. Got him. <laughs> so uh, the next place we should be going should be here, if I remember correctly. I'm not too sure. But, uh... Okay, A. I almost pushed Y again. My uh, thumb was reaching towards that button. <laughs> Maybe the zombies respawned by now. Probably. It took me a while to get through uh, that area. So in the meantime, let's get rid of any hazards that are in my way. 
Alright, seems like we're clear. Alright, let's go back to Jacob's Cove. I think this is when a special, uh, a very special claptrap shows up. Maybe not now, uh, maybe in the very near future. But he's quite funny, too. So, free ammo, why not? And we are already full on equal from equalizers. Nice. Oh, we'll rescue you in a second. So let's grab a new, new professionals. In hindsight, it was probably against our better judgment to let him make such an attempt, but his passion and outside the box thinking convinced us. Unfortunately, he was not the last person hired to handle our situation. And here we go again. Find out what happened to the others who came to stop the zombies. Whoever or to whomever discovers the circumstances of Jackie Hall or Jackie O'Callahan's death, HR has inf or uh, human relations. I don't know. I think that's what HR stands for. Has informed me that there were four others like yourself who were hired to deal with the issue. These employees also seem to have run into some difficulties. Try to determine what happened to them. All right. Oh yeah, I missed a lot of dialogue. You might have read it in the subtitles. Alright, I guess we can rescue him. I did miss a little things, but there's just so much going on, and I can barely hear what's going on on the TV. I have it, like, really low, just loud enough so I can hear the gunshots and some sounds, but nothing else. So, Claptrap was hacked. Investigate the story about Dr. Ned. Alright. Secrets and Mysteries. Someone hacked into Claptrap and left you a cryptic message. You were told that Dr. Ned is not to be trusted and you can find Dr. Ned's old laboratory or laboratory <laughs> by taking a boat off the island. Find Ned's lab and use the secret knock to enter. Alright. A lot of freedom. Eh, whatever. New quest. It's alive. Uncover what happened to Frank Igorsky and deliver his sever or severance. To any employee of the Jacobs Corporation, we at Hypertemps, a division of Hyperion Industrial, offer an invitation to whoever or whoever. Damn it! I can't say that word. Ugh. Whomever can determine the whereabouts of the contractor we sent to work with the Jacobs Company physician, Frank Igorsky has not reported to his agent for over a month. As a direct result of this behavior, Frank has been terminated. We now have a severance package that needs to be delivered to him. Please find information about his new situation and deliver the package. Alright, and the pack. Uh, this is the other quest that we had at General Lee Hospital, but we couldn't actually get to, so. Dr. Ned here. Seems like my antidote from Skagblood didn't quite have the intended result. You're lucky you survived your encounter with the so-called Skag. I wish I could say he was the only one, but the other test subjects seem to have formed a pact and are terrorizing the coastline by the old hospital. You should really take care of them to avoid the spread of that disease as well. Man, sometimes I wonder if maybe I should have been a villain instead of an NPC. <laughs> so, funny enough. So, uh, yeah, we got a lot of quests, but uh, I think this is about time I ended off. So, uh, thank you guys for watching this episode of Let's Play Borderlands. I'm pretty uh, set up myself for uh, screwing things up. and um, uh, It's a shorter episode than usual, but uh, I probably should keep it that way. So, uh, you know, uh, in the meantime, hopefully things get a little more interesting as we continue on with this thing. Uh, it's a little more lonely than I thought it would be uh, in this in this area. Just kind of the the uh, the atmosphere of it, and uh, not having friends to play along with is not as fun. So, you know, maybe we can do a co-commentary with one of my friends. We'll see. We'll see what we can do. I thought I blew that up. <laughs> so, uh, thank you guys, and I will see everyone later.